achieved with Blender. Welcome to the third devlog of planned game Wire Soul. This part will be devoted to First Stinger's ability to manipulate with time, and that will be stopping time. Stop and restart time is done by pressing R. Stinger itself is immune against any manipulation of time. Usage of stopping time to overcome the obstacles is demonstrated in the several examples. The first obstacle is a laser ditch. It is too wide for jumping over, and lasers move too fast for Stingy managed to run between them. However, if we stop time it stops even the lasers and Stingy can pass carefully between them. Here we can see a classical example of usage of Hedron known from previous devlog. But it differ in that for the opening of the second door is needed again the same tetrahedron, which can be only one in the room. Again, we use a stopping time, in fact, that Stingy is not affected by time, and is therefore able to continue to manipulate with the environment. This way Stingy gets into situation, when it is not longer possible to return, but in this case it doesn't matter. In the next room is the so-called blue plasma wall which destroys hedrons. Stingy however cannot be hurt. Later in the game you will encounter with the red version, which is the opposite, hedron passes without problems, however Stingy is destroyed. To avoid the constant destruction of hedrons, we can try and capture it in flight, or at the right moment stop the time, and simply pick it up. Here, are only for demonstration purposes so-called one-way platforms. They are set so that each could Stingy enter only once. The moment Stingy gets off from the platform, the platform plugs into the wall and there is no way to reactivate it again. In the last room of this level we have again the blue type of plasma wall and closed gate. The gate opens only from the other side of the wall, where Stingier must step on the marked location for him. One of the many ways to solve this puzzle, is to try to throw Hedron through the upper door, and open them before the Hedron hit them. Stingy can't reach such speed, so he will help us again with stopping time.
These were a few examples of the usage of stopping time, and next time we will see more advanced features such as recording the time period, and its subsequent playback. Thank you for your time and I look forward to meet you at another devlog.